title of this message is Make Enemies to be at Peace. When we think of September 11, it reminds us of the, the shaking of the scattering of the peace of the whole world by attacking the Twin Tower in the US. The enmity group between uh, two groups of people, they all were very well. The enmity grew even now. But the Bible says, when a man's ways are pleasing to the law, he makes even his enemies to be at peace with him. We may think how to love our enemies. We may think how to accept our enemies. We may think how we can lead a, a peaceful life with enemies. Is it possible? Yes, it is possible. The Bible says, when a man's ways are pleasing to God, when man leads his way as God likes it, he can make even his enemies to be at peace with him. Proverbs chapter 16 verse 7. When a man's ways pleases to God means, God is the guardian and defends of all that fear and love him. So we must please God. It is surprising to see how wonderfully God works and acts in our life. So we must please God. God raising up friends to us, so we must please God. He is turning their enemies into friends, so we must please God. It is very difficult to turn the enemies into friends, but God can do that. Goodness has power to charm and win even enemies. When a man's ways are pleasing to God, it is a conditional state. If you think, if you experience that your enemies should be have, should have a peace with you, yes, but there is a condition. What is the condition? You should your ways should be pleasing to God. When it would be considered that a man's ways are pleasing to God, when a man walks according to the rules of his word, when a man walks follows the word of God, and when he when a man follows the commandments of God, it is considered that his ways are pleasing to God. When he walks as Christ as his example, walks in the footprints of Jesus Christ, his ways will be pleasing to God. When he walks after the spirit, not after the flesh, it is the sign of pleasing God. When we walk with faith and does not and thus everything in faith is a sign of pleasing God. When we give importance to the Holy Spirit, when we have faith in our life, it is a sign that we please God in our life. Without which it is impossible to please God. And all His ways and actions glorify God. God will bless us and make our, even our enemies to have peace with us. Secondly, he makes enemies to be at peace with him. When a man's ways pleases God, he makes even his enemies to be at peace with him. As Abimelech and with Isaac, as Esau and Jacob, and the enemies of the church and the people of God in the first century church are the best examples. And even now, we may have the difference between and the people of different faiths. We may have difference of opinion, but if God can make all these differences, God can bridge the gap and even make our enemies to have a better life and peaceful life with us. God can turn man's enemies into friends. He can change their minds or force them to be submissive. He can slay all enmities and bring those together that were at greatest distance from each other. He will do it for us when we please Him. If we reconcile to God and commit ourselves to Him and love Him, He will make those who have been envious towards us and exercise cause annoyance and worry to us and make them as our friends. The image of God is appearing upon the righteous and protects us. Let us not be worried and disturbed when somebody hates and 
have envious of us because the God of peace is with us to give us his peace in our life when our ways are facing to him. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.